Unfortunately, this is completely true. In most cases, the healthier the relationship, the more the avoidant is frightened, the more their fears are triggered, and the more they deactivate. That's because avoidants have learned to fear emotional intimacy. They fear being abandoned, and it's a healthy partner that triggers the fears of abandonment. That's because the healthy partner treats the avoidant well. The avoidant feels like this person is better than they deserve. Plus, when the partner is emotionally available, there's an unspoken pressure for the avoidant to be emotionally available and vulnerable in return. That scares the avoidant. So healthy relationships actually make avoidance feel emotionally unsafe. Severe avoidance, that is. Toxic relationships or relationships with an emotionally unavailable partner, the avoidant feels more safe in. That's because the toxic partner or the emotionally unavailable partner is also walled off. They're also emotionally unavailable. So there's no pressure for the avoidant to be vulnerable or available for this person. It feels safe. It feels easy. And it feels emotionally safe for the avoidant. Whereas the healthy partner, well, there's fear of abandonment there. But the toxic partner, they're not that special. So there's no fear of abandonment by somebody who just isn't that special.